What play are you here to see? I don't understand. <clears throat> what play are you here to see? I'm here to see Fig. Fig? I don't recognize that title. Try again. business. Enforcer, over here, please. May I ask what you're doing in a place like this? I'm looking for a forgotling. Well, you found one. Funny. Does the name Mr. Fig mean anything to you? Nope. But I was never good with names. This forgotling might be dangerous and is probably a regular here. It's a popular bar. A lot of forgotlings come here. I don't ask questions, I just serve drinks. You know who I am? I sure do. So does everyone else. If you think you can throw your weight around here, think again. I don't know how you got in, and I don't care. You're welcome to look around the bar as long as you follow the house rule. Which is? Don't start a fight. respect that you've got a job, even if I find it distasteful. But I also expect you to return the courtesy and not trash my bar. everything, as we like to call it. So good. <laughs> Preach it, Sonny. Pure as rain. We're 
forgotten. Totally. That's why we've ended up down here, right? Yeah. But we forget stuff all the time. Southern Cross. was it for tonight? It's probably the projector. No piece of rubbish. Hey, I heard that. Shouldn't be here. Don't know anyone called Fig. 
and I don't belong in these parts. Ugh. I'm Sidarius, and you're the Enforcer. Wow, you see everything, don't you? Someone's looking for you. Who? He's right here in the bar. And? You're not looking in his direction. I'm looking at you. Tell me where he is. How does it feel, never having seen it? Seen what? The ether. Everybody's been there, except you. I'm a human. I was born there. Right you are. Of course. My mistake. When I don't get my anima, I start rambling. If only I could get a drink. Alas, the bartender has cut me off. It's a big misunderstanding, really. I know how it sounds, but... If I get you a drink, you'll tell me where Fig is. Oh, yes. And a lot more. Let's just keep it to that. Sidereus is a nice guy, and he only ever has one drink at night. But after that drink, I'm telling you, he starts preaching. Preaching? Yeah, becomes all philosophical. What are you doing with your life? Stuff like that. He even asks us to look through him. He's bad for business. I can't see the harm in making you forgotlings think a bit more. Forgotlings come here to forget they are forgotten. Not to get lectured about how they're not applying themselves. I'll make sure he doesn't give any lectures tonight. He tells me that I'm empty inside. Well, you are a refrigerator. He wants me to pursue music. Coming here, putting crazy thoughts of forgottenings who've got problems enough with the way things are. Music! Ha! Can you imagine a fridge like me, hammering piano keys? So what if I like music? Bartending is all I've ever known. That's the purpose I took with me from the ether. You should give yourself a chance. Nobody's forcing you to continue what you're doing now. You think so? Hmm, I'll think about it. But I'm not letting Sidereus tell me. So, no drinks for him tonight? I'll leave a drink here on the house. Will you give it to us? Persuasive himself. Big. Right. Sorry. Listen carefully. Over by the movie lounge, there's a decommissioned anima pipe. 
That pipe leads into an office where Mr. Fig is having a meeting tonight. The pipe is quite high up, but I'm sure you can reach it. The movie lounge. Hmm. Thanks. See you around. Probably on her way right now. Just do your part. I will, but I'm not staying around for this. What's that supposed to mean? You're taking an unnecessary risk. I'm done here. Hey, Bob. of you to drop in. Clever move using the pipes. I must admit, I've been looking forward to meeting you, Anne. But where are my manners? My name is Mr. Fig. I'm the enforcer, and I'm placing you under arrest, Fig. <laughs> You've got style. But, of course, I won't let you send me to the plant, and you're not using the arc on me either. Don't force my hand. It seems I only have a rebel's choice. So long, Anne. Try to keep up. Presser? A marionette! Stop! Hey, 
as you wish. Since you spend so much time on Banku's shoulder, perhaps Little Hawk is more fitting. your attention, though. How noble. We only target machinery. How many forgotten lives did you take on your way here? That's irrelevant. It always is. You almost destroyed a segment of the Ether Bridge, and we'd never get home. This is your home. Have you ever lived anywhere else?
careful there.
a pest. Get off her, I said. Fellow forgotlings, we finally caught her. The one who steals away our friends, abducts our families, and suppresses innocent forgotlings. I give you the Enforcer. Yes! What in the realm are you doing, Bob? What do you think this is? A witch hunt? The Enforcer is on trial for her multitude of crimes against forgotlings. Does the Enforcer have counsel? If not, I'll speak on her behalf. Whatever you're trying to do, stop it and get me out of here. I want to hear what she has to say. Fine, you speak for the girl. I assume we can agree that we need to remove the Arca from her hand. Then we need to... No. Are you suggesting we let her keep the Arca? I am. You'd let her walk around with a weapon capable of distilling us all. Think of everything she's done to us. Yeah! What has she done exactly? Where should I start? She aids Bonku in his assault on the realm. She distills forgotlings at her pleasure. She treats us like things. And she assumes everyone wants to return to the ether. Who doesn't want to go back home to the ether? That's where we belong, and Master Bunker's ether bridge will get us there. Tell me, Anne, do you understand what the ether is? What is this home you talk about? We all came from the ether, and that's where we should return. Why? What? We belong in the real world, with the humans. We were taken from our home and forgotten. Do you have memories of your home? I... I remember... Or perhaps you remember the stories Banku told you. What does home look like? What are humans like? Have you ever seen a sunset? What does an ice cream feel like on your tongue? I... I thought you wanted to speak on my behalf. You're evading the subject, Fig. The Enforcer is a threat. Her actions speak for themselves. Let me refresh your memory. You all remember Dilly. Brave, loyal Dilly. <laughs> the Enforcer distilled him. She didn't have to. She enjoyed it. Make no mistake about that. Yeah! <laughs> that forgotling broke into my home. And now you are in our home. Remember when Station Master Pax helped us escape on the train at Tower Ground Station? The Enforcer could have distilled him when she pursued us, but didn't. Leaving rebels at the station. Not very smart, Enforcer. She sent that trigger-happy handgun Magnum on the most skilled mission planner in our ranks. Have you seen or heard from Hilto since we got off the train? Has anyone? Remember how she manipulated that neighborhood into setting up a mirror in the streets? She actually made them believe it was for their own good. Well played, Enforcer. Fear, isn't that your strongest weapon? It's no stranger to you either, I see. How dare you talk to me like that? That's right, keep pushing your lies. I'm not dignifying that with the response. But of course you're not. I'd say she outsmarted us in scrappers, Bob. The way she snuck up on us? Ha! Regardless, 
It's clear that the Enforcer is a threat. We need to disarm her and use the Arca against Bonker. Calm down! Stop it! I can't defend all of her actions, but you heard how she reacted when I asked her about the Aether. She has lived here her whole life. Remember who taught her everything she knows. Banku did. She is just as much a victim as we are. Hmm? I'm not a victim. I'm trying to sort out this mess and get us all back to where we belong. Why is that so hard to understand? We can't hold Anne responsible for what she's done while wearing the blindfold of Banku. The Enforcer is not as strong as you think. She's a threat, and we need to deal with her now. Yeah! Calm down! Quiet down, please! There's something you don't know about, Anne. Something none of you know. Anne is not a human being. She's a forgotling. Then why hasn't she crystallized yet? Anne and Bonku each have an Arca. The Arcas keep crystallization at bay. If we take the Arca from Anne, she'll crystallize. What? What? I'd like to call in a witness. Blanket, if you please. Hello, Anne. We met on the train. So you were a rebel after all! Fig is right. You're forgotten just like us. You're a forgotling. What? I've known you my whole life, Anne. We arrived in the realm together when you were a baby. I was the blanket you were wrapped in. Do you know where I'm from? Do you know who my mother is? Nonsense! Think about what the Arca can do for us. So what if the Enforcer crystallizes? It's about time she gets a dose of her own medicine. We need to distill the Enforcer, and we need to do it now. Justice! If you all feel that removing her Arca will make you feel safe, then we remove her Arca. However, no one is getting distilled under my leadership. I want her to at least crystallize peacefully. Perfect. If anyone wishes to shelter this freak while she's crystallizing, speak up. That's what I thought. Now, go get that arc. Yeah! Did you sleep well? It hurts. I know, dear. And you... Do you know what happened to me? Why am I here? Shh. We'll have time to talk about that later. Without the Arca, I'll... I'll... Well, not instantly, dear. Crystallization comes to all of us. For now, you should try to relax. Seem that aged. 
Regardless, I unfortunately cannot let you pass.
These forgottenlings died a natural death. As they reached a certain age, they just quietly crystallized. It's actually quite beautiful. How long before that happens to me? About a day, I'd say. Will it hurt? Not at all. I'm not ready for this. Then why don't we go get the Arca back? What? But I thought... I never wanted you distilled. I don't want to see you crystallized either. Then what do we do? I want to give you the Arca and get you out of here. How? Bob keeps the Arca safe at his house. I don't understand. I need you to distract him long enough for me to steal it. What? Afterwards, you escape and meet me on the surface. Take this map. Your escape route is marked on it. And you'll just get the Arca back after all that, of course. You are really looking forward to life as a crystal, aren't you? <sighs> Where are you helping me? I believe in you. Here's the plan. Bob wants to use the Arca to attack Bunker. That's why he has sent for a specialist, a forgottenling who knows the layout of the tower grounds. You will pose as that specialist. How am I supposed to do that? I have a friend waiting for you in the storage room. He'll fill you in. Wait, are we doing it right now? We have no time to lose. I'll create a diversion so you can get out of here unseen. It's time for me to speak up. Fellow Forgottenlings, I see before me a group with the potential to do anything. Difficult times are ahead, sure, but we have overcome difficult times in the past. We will not let Bonku manipulate us into seeing the world through his eyes. We. not objects. We are not inferior. I'm asking you to trust me, and that's not a small thing to ask. But I assure you, I have a plan. I will leave you for a short while very soon, but I will be back. And if everything goes as planned, the tables will have turned. I'd like you to remember that we have a guest. Treat her with respect just as you would any Forgottenlings. Her past actions may cast a long shadow, but I stand by my words when I say that she too is a victim of Banku. Surprise! You? In the ink. I escaped. So you did. Let's get it on you. Get what on me? The disguise I made for you. You can change behind that screen. Amazing. 
Don't make fun. No, no, it's even better than I imagined. Bulb won't suspect a thing. Really? Here's the plan. Bulb has the Arca in his house. We're gonna get it back. How will you do that? I will present you to Bulb as the specialist. And when we're in his house, you make sure to keep him busy. Meanwhile, I open a window so Fig can steal the Arca. Simple. me at first glance. No, he won't. Trust me, you look just like a moving box who got lost in the warehouse. In fact, you look a lot like my third cousin, but he might recognize your voice, so you'd better not speak. How can I keep Bob busy without speaking? Trust me, Bob will do the talking. You just nod and shake your head, literally. What if I need to get your attention? Then wave and make some kind of sound. Let's try. Can you nod? Like you're confirming what I see. Ha! Ah, yes! Perfect! Very convincing. Now, let's have you shake your head like you're disagreeing. Yes! It works! Bob won't suspect a thing. Now, let's try the weave. <laughs> That's fantastic! There's an actor hidden in you, Anne. You're ready. Let's go get your Arca back. Yeah, that's the spirit. I'll meet you at Bulb's house. I was rather pleased with Bulb's leadership. He did get results, but I'm talking about a long-term resolution to the conflict. Affirmative. That would be acceptable. But Fig is too liberal. Limits equality in themselves? I say we need discipline. Order. Bulb is the right for Godling to provide that. If that's what you want, only time will tell if you get it. The leaders should work together. We could have the best of both. I think that's what they're trying to do, most of the time. Affirmative. I hope so. with the specialist. Perfect. Come in. I don't remember seeing your friend before. Ah, Bulb. A joker as always. Of course you recognize the great, great Boxton. He's had key roles on several missions to the Tower Grounds. And I don't have to mention the incident in this morning's operation, I take it. Oh, great Boxton. Certainly, of course. I'm on it. That was quite a... a thing you did. He, uh, he doesn't talk much after the incident. I'm sure you understand. Of course. Well, come with me. I've got the plans for our next mission upstairs. Keep him busy. This, Mr. Boxton, is the plan of our next attack on the tower grounds. With your expertise, I'm sure we can improve it. The Watchtower has always been a problem for us, but during the last mission we sabotaged the gates. My hope is that you have information about exactly how much damage we inflicted. Can we walk straight through the Watchtower now? I see. That's news to me. I'll plot that in on the plan. What about the workshop? This morning's attack revealed that the last segment of the Ether Bridge is kept there. Did you see anyone guarding it? Really? No guards? That's great news. I guess he relied completely on the Enforcer. We have a chance of destroying the last bridge segment then. Excellent! Any other security measures at the workshop? Mirrors, perhaps?
I see. So we might be able to get in after all. Splendid. By the way, those are some peculiar boots you have. Where have I seen boots like that before? They remind me of... Say, Bald, did you know that Mr. Boxton is also very well informed about anima systems and Arca theory? Really? That's wonderful timing. I have so many questions. Let's go downstairs. Between you and me, I'm experimenting with the Arca. I'm close to figuring out how to wield it. See the schematics, Mr. Boxton. I've tried to map out how the Arca works. If my theory is correct, we're just scratching the surface of what this thing can do, and so is the Enforcer. Look, doesn't it seem like the Arca can actually store anima? Really? I got it right. I bet you had a similar theory, didn't you? I knew it! The Arca can store anima! Remarkable! Fig, that wooden wimp is too scared to use it. I think we can do great things with the Arca. Are we on the same page, Mr. Boxton? Of course, a seasoned veteran such as yourself can recognize an opportunity when he sees it. Hey, you! Plumage! No snooping around. Stay down here. No one goes upstairs without my permission. Did you hear me? I don't want you upstairs. Oh, of course not. I understand. Say, why don't you ask the Enforcer? <laughs> what I meant was, why don't you inform Mr. Boxton about your Arca theory? Oh, yes, I think you'll like this. My other theory is that the Arca could be among the very first crystals in existence. Perhaps even the one with which our whole world originated. What do you think about that, Mr. Boxton? Yes, it makes sense, doesn't it? To think that I might have some kind of cornerstone to our existence in my possession. Hey, what's going on? I thought I told you no snooping around. You sneaky feather duster. What do you think you're doing? There! That sly little forger. Sorry about this, Mr. Boxton. I have to see if everything is all right with the Arca. I can't stop staring at it to think it's finally mine. Yes, I'm on my way. I don't understand. Imagine, I could be the forgotling who discovers how to reverse the crystallization process. I'm on my way. What do you mean? Yes, yes, I'm on my way. What? Yes, yes, I'm on my way. What do you want? Yes, yes, I'm on my way. I don't understand. Yes, yes, I'm on my way. What do you mean? Yes, yes, I'm on my way. What? Yes, yes, I'm on my way. What do you want? Yes, yes, I'm on my way. I don't understand. 
Yes, yes, I'm on my way. We're here. Now, what is it? Why did you? You lured me down here, didn't you? You want the Arca for yourself. No, no, that's absurd. I'm sorry, Mr. Boxton, but I am surrounded by forgotlings who lust for power and can't be trusted. What? No! No, no, no! It's gone! No, no, no! That was my last chance! I'm finished! This is it! I'm done for! I'll find that thief and make him pay! Has anyone seen the Enforcer or that sly little quip? Fear not, help is on the way.
He promised he'd be here. harder than I thought. The whole place is in an uproar after your escape and the disappearance of the Arca. Why are you helping me? I told you. I believe in you. And you're essential to bringing peace between the Forgotlings and Bonku. That's what Master Bonku is trying to do. I know, but I'm confident you will succeed where he has failed. Before we do anything else, I have to show you the plant. The plant? Why? Let's call it the price of my help. I don't see what good it'll do. It's important, and you owe me a favor. I'm not sure what you're up to, but you did save my life. Don't go thinking I'm suddenly on your side, though. Are you on Blanket's side, then? Blanket is... I don't know. A lot has happened, and I don't understand most of it. Just show me what you want me to see. Come with me. The answers will follow. Follow me, Anne. Been here before? No, I've never been all the way out here. I should call Master Bonku just to let him know I'm all right. That's not a good idea, Anne. I usually report back several times a day. He must be worried. Why don't you call him after I've shown you the plant? Come on, there's an old service track outside we can use.
Lester. Anne, are you all right? I'm sorry I didn't... What mirror are you calling from? The old checkpoint seven. What are you doing out there? I know, Master. I'm sorry. You wouldn't believe what happened to me. Chief Inspector Magnum told me you are hunting this fig character. I followed him into the sewers. The sewers? I want you home immediately, Anne. Struck just delivered the last segment of the ether bridge. I need only to install it. The rebels cannot interfere anymore. Forget fig. I can't come home now, Master. You need to do something first. What are you hiding, Anne? I'm not hiding anything, Master. I know Fig is nearby. I want you home right now, young lady. What's at the plant? What? What's at the plant? You know about the plant. It's our main generator and a facility housing criminals. Godlings. I need to see it. Come home, man. Let's talk about it. Tell me what's at the plant. Please. I will not tolerate insubordination. Do as I say. Goodbye, Master Ponku. Wait. Be careful if you meet Fig. You cannot trust him. Oh, and Anne. Yes, Master? Remember, I... Master Ponku? Hello? Well, I'm trying to get the service car running. I called Master Banku, but a sudden anima outage cut the transmission. Do you know anything about that? What's that supposed to mean? All I wanted was to make sure he didn't worry. I was just making sure we could use the service car. You're right. I I'm sorry. I don't want to argue. A lot has happened today. I know. I'm sorry to drag you through all of this. Let's just get going and talk about something else. Of course. What do you do for fun? What? You know, when you're not out enforcing. Why are you asking me that? I just want to get to know you better. I train at the watchtower. You know, jumping, climbing, using the arca. Staying in shape is good. I'm partial to fencing myself. I'm not very good at it. I once accidentally stabbed my teacher. To be fair, she was a dummy. So are you. Touche. So what else do you do? I collect things. What kind of things? Things that catch my eye. Things that feel nice when I hold them. See? We already know each other a little better. I have to admit, you're not all bad. Why, thank you, great Madame Enforcer. So, Fig, what's with the wig? The, the what? I'm not... It's not a... It's a wig. I know you lost one at Central Station, and you replaced that. So, you found one of my many dark secrets. Yes, I wear a wig. That doesn't make me a bad forgotling. Not at all. In fact, it provides me with a certain charisma. Oh, I agree. About the interruption of your call to Bonku. Let's not talk about that. Actually, I'm sort of looking forward to some plant. I've never had a chance before. Something important always came up. We're almost at the plant. Fig? 
Yeah? You remember the ether, don't you? Well, the whole ether business is a little different when you're forgotten. In the ether, Forgotling has a single purpose. The form we're given. I was a posing doll. A simple job. In the ether, that's all I could be. Down here, I can be who I want to be. But all Forgotlings here long to return to the ether. If you don't realize you can be anything but a teapot, you'll never try to be anything but a teapot. Once I reach the ether, I'll know who I want to be. When I first arrived here, I had no clue who I was or my purpose. Actually, for a long time, I was on Bunku's side. <laughs> You're serious. Returning to the ether may not magically make you realize who you can be. This entrance, Anne. We don't have to sneak in. I'm the enforcer. And to them, I'm the rebel leader. Good point. We'll take your way. Door is locked. Workers sleep here. Well, those who get to sleep. Welcome to the realm. It's all very 
be confusing, but it's only temporary. Master Bonku will have you ready and settled with a purpose soon enough. You work hard and earn that ether ticket back home. Is that what I think it is? This is where forgottenlings arrive from the ether. So many forgotten things. What are they doing with them? They're deciding the future. It's an employment center. I suppose you could call it that. We'll just hitch a ride for the transport system again. Try the lever.
I'll open it up for you from here. Nicely done, Anne. What was it you wanted to talk about? Between you and me, do you think we'll get our tickets to the Ether Bridge? What do you mean? Think about it. What's our guarantee that Master Bunku will keep his promise? You don't like working here? Jill has worked here longer than both of us. She hasn't seen any sign of a ticket yet. Well, you won't get a ticket talking like that. Come on, let's get back to work. I can't believe how that validated for Gotling talked about Master Bunk. heading up.
this way yet. Do you ever think about our job? Don't start that again. I'm not. I'm just wondering if you ever feel bad. Yes, I feel bad all the time. I feel bad that no one seems to appreciate that we're slaving to provide the city with anima. And I feel bad that even a validated forgotling like you questions the purpose that Mars Tabonku gave you. There are so many other places we could work. Yes, I'm sure you want to clean streets, demolish buildings, or set up security mirrors. You know what I mean. I don't have a clue. And if I were you, I'd be careful with spreading that rebel talk around. I'm not rebel talking, I'm just thinking. Don't. It's better that way. We need to find another way. We have to find a way to get this door open.
Fig, could you help me here? Oh, you're right. We need to flip them at the same time. Ready? Ready? Three, two, one, go! Another way in. Pull the switch and Ready? Three, two, one. Ready? Three, two, one. Go. Maybe there's a switch somewhere. Nicely done, Anne. This way, Anne. Come on. It's a misunderstanding. We can work out. You were caught red-handed faking ether bridge tickets. There's only one place for you. I can make it worth your while. I'm sure there's something. Be quiet. Do you realize what a forgotling like me can do for you? Not interested. Stop talking. You don't understand. I'm not cut out for hard labor, but I'm a wizard with numbers. For crying out loud, would you shut up? Come on. I'll do anything. Ah, I got something you could do, actually. Yes, finally. What do you need? Could you take a few steps back, please? You got it. treatment of forgotlings. I'll report this to Master Bonk. We haven't even scratched the surface. Come on. I'm sorry. Quill didn't deserve this. No, he didn't. Uh, 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 uh. 
Let's take the stairs anyway. Follow your lead. Fig! Rennie! Hi, I was, uh, hoping you were doing your rounds. I knew you'd come back. Then you also know what I'm here to do, and why the Enforcer's with me. I can't allow that, Fig. Fig? What's going on? Oh, Fig used to work here. Is that true, Fig? Did you work here? I was afraid you'd refuse to go if you knew. It'll all make sense very soon, Anne. Your answer is right behind that door. Everything will change if you show her this. I'm counting on it. We're going through that door. I'm reporting you to Master Bonku as soon as you do. Sorry, but you're not. <laughs> Anne, look, I... I don't want to hear it, Fig. Just show me whatever it is you want me to see. This way. You could have told me you used to work here. It wouldn't have mattered. What do you mean? I chose to follow you here. And I chose to trust you. You're right. I should have been more honest with you. I'm sorry. Whatever happens, I want to be your friend. I am your friend. You understand? Fig, what are you going to show me? Taking care of them as we speak. No! 
Oh, and what do we have here? The thing that calls itself Mr. Fig. Do you think you can trust that forgotling hand? Did it ever hide anything from you? Did it always tell you the truth? I... Anne, I miss you. I miss us spending time together. I've been so busy lately. If you come home, we can leave all this behind and just be us.
The depleter? All right. I hope you know what you're doing. Come on, Anne. You heard Banku. He found the sewers. We have to go. Take my hand! Wait. What are you doing? We have to go! What's wrong? I need some time. We don't have time for this. Bob needs help protecting the others. Everything is backwards. I'm sorry I put you through this, but I didn't know any other way to open your eyes. I need to clear my head. We can't let the others down. Please come with me. We need you and your Arca. Everyone wants something from me. I need you to be strong. Banku has probably already... You've turned everything upside down. Can we do this later? I don't even know who I am anymore. We don't have time. Ever since you brought me into this, you've only been thinking about yourself. And listen. You're just like everyone else. You'll say anything to get me to do what you want. You have no idea what you're doing or what's at stake. You're a stupid, soulless forgotling. And please, let that be unsaid. Leave me alone. Do what you need to do. But I have to go. Bye, Anne. Fig? Fig, wait! Come back, Fig! I'm sorry, I didn't mean it! Fig!
This can't be real. Can you feel the grass? The wind on your face? Can you hear the leaves? Do you smell the dew? You might find it overwhelming. Your kind consider this a place of serenity.
who built masterful creations in this world and the other. Creations made to last generations. Bonku displayed unique examples of his beautiful handcraft. But the world has moved on. What was he to do? He screamed and he cursed. He clung to a world that no longer valued him or his talent. Bonku formed a wish and disappeared inside it until it became true. One day everyone was truly gone and so was he. As he realized where he was, the thought of going back became all-consuming. He immediately forgot the hardships of the other world. A strange hunger grew in him as he devised a way to return. But his accomplishment will lead to his demise. You mean the Ether Bridge? There must be a way to save Banku. Bonku has planted you here, and your roots are his. You need to make a choice. What choice?
don't know your own story, but these crystals remember.
The only question you need to ask is, what does your heart desire? Forgive you.
doing here? Get out! Wait! This is all your fault. He'd never have found us if it wasn't for you. No, I came here to... Leave! You don't belong here! Leave us alone! for this enforcer. This is where all your actions have led us. You're right. No, Anne. He's right. It's all my fault.
did you do to it? Put that arca down. Show some respect, girl. Where is it? <gasps> Impossible. Fig? What did you do to me? I don't know. I was gone. I'm so sorry, Fig. I guess a stupid, soulless thing like myself will have to settle for that. I don't believe it. You think I'd leave you in charge, Bob? And what happened after I left? The short version? I walked into a cave. I met a spirit in there, and she changed my Arcasimi. She told me she was the world's first memory. She also told me that if Banku turns on the ether bridge, the world will cease to exist. Well, she met a spirit in a crystal cave. Don't start. She met the caretaker. There's no question about it. It's the only explanation for all of this. The caretaker doesn't exist. A spirit in a cave? A first memory? One who just happened to give Anne the ability to revive Gotlings? I don't care. But if our Arca can revive distilled forgotlings, I'm afraid we do need our help. What do you say, Enforcer? Should we set aside our differences? Let's do it. Wonderful. The first thing we need to... I'm joining Fig, not you. Well, I guess that's better than nothing. I have a plan, and as much as I hate to admit it, we need your help, Enforcer. So no Forgotling will ever be distilled or hurt again. I couldn't have put it better myself, then. Fig, why are you staring at me? No reason. There are a lot of distilled Forgotlings outside. I better get to work. When you're done, let's meet in the hall and discuss our plan of attack. service track we used and drove back. I arrived here expecting the worst, but everyone was fine. I was in the middle of delivering my report when I heard an explosion, and Banku himself came through the roof on a mining lift. He was here? In person? Are you sure you want to hear the end of this? Of course. Tell me everything. Well, Banku 
broke through the roof. Validated forgotlings were everywhere. They set fire to the linen. Before I knew it, everything burned. Banku was distilling everyone that crossed his path. I decided to hide the survivors in the memorial. There, we sat. Just waiting for him. And of course, he found us. I got up, and I looked him in the eye. Then he yelled, Where is she? But before I could answer, the light faded around me. No pain, just darkness creeping in from all sides. The next thing I know, the light returned, and there you are. I'm sorry you had to go through that. We have to stop him. We will. I know exactly how we can take Baku down with one swift blow. I look forward to hearing your thoughts, sir. What's the plan? Recently, I spoke to a forgotling with insight into the tower grounds. I've crafted a plan based on the information he gave me. Who was this forgotling, and where is he now? I'm afraid I haven't seen him after the attack. What was his name? It was none other 
than the great Great Boxton. Who is this unsung hero? The bravest forgotling I've ever met. Uh, Bob? It was me in disguise. I'm Crate Boxton. What? We wanted to get the Arca back. That can't be right. It's true. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Remember? It was you. You tricked me. I am sorry about that, Bob. But I have a suggestion. A plan? Yes. Here's my plan. We simply walk in. Through the main gate? Banku sealed that a long time ago. There's a secret entrance in my house, though. I knew it. Dilly was right. You still need to get past the checkpoints at the central station and tower grounds. We'll pretend I've caught Fig. Everyone will think I was on Banku's side all along. That's quite a gamble. It'll work. The secret tower entrance in my house is protected with an Arca lock. I can't open it alone. I'll go with you. Maybe the two of you can sneak in, but you'll need backup in case something goes wrong. He's right. Let me round up my friends from Scrappers. Once Fig and I are inside the tower, we can turn off Banku's security systems, and then the road will be clear for Bulb and his friends. When we see the security system is off, we blow a hole in the wall and storm in. All right, but I want to speak to Banku before you do anything, Bulb. I have to convince him not to activate the ether bridge. Anne is right. Fiscal confrontation is our last resort. Did you hear that, Bob? Yes, yes, fine. I wish you the very best of luck. The journey is dangerous. The town will be occupied by forgotlings loyal to Bonku, not to mention lost pieces. What about the thing up in the top of the tower? That's just a story. There's nothing living in the tower except Bonku. Let's not start with the ghost stories. I think we all deserve a good night's sleep before we leave tomorrow. Anne, you can rest at my place. Did you see the force of her here? She can summon for God and back to life. That's crazy. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Good evening, Anne. The bed is ready for you. You must be tired. I am. Thank you, Blanket. Good night. Sweet dreams, Anne. Blanket? Hmm? What do you remember from your life in the ether? It's a strange thing. You don't remember your life up there until you arrive here. What do you mean? I remember being there. I remember being wrapped around you. I remember your mother. But I was not really there. Oh. I'm the luckiest forgotling here, you know. I'm already with my owner. I like that. Me too. Uh, 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 see you tomorrow, Blanket. Good night, Anne. I cannot believe I have to adjust this again. You are growing so fast. I want to be this big. Oh, you will. Just one more adjustment. Arca is ready again. Why do I have to wear that? Because you are very, very special, Anne. We'll always be together, right? Of course. Time to get up, Blanket. Blanket? My blanket. Morning, Anne. Ready to go? What's wrong? Oh. Are you all right? Yes. It was her time. I had such a good talk with her last night. About the ether. I'll have someone move her to the memorial. Thank you. <sighs> well, let's go.
Let's go then. Which way do you suggest we take? Uh, if we want to keep out of Banku's way, we have to take the lower streets. You know the lower streets aren't safe. We'll make it. Let's go through here.
Good teamwork in there. 